Is it time to buy or sell NVIDIA stock? In this video, we're delving deeper into NVIDIA. Our initial report was published on our website on Friday, March 8, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. Stay informed to not miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Access free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one of 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since January 5, 2024, our system has identified NVIDIA as a buy candidate with a score of 1.58. Now, let's delve into the stock's performance over this period. Investors who heeded our analysis would have seen a significant increase of 78.28% since we recommended NVIDIA as a buy candidate 44 days ago. This equates to an average daily return of 1.78% since it was designated as a buy candidate. The stock is currently in the midst of a strong upward trend, indicating a potential further rise. Over the next three months, there is a projected 83.58% change, with a possible return ranging from 59.34% to 95.84%. Looking ahead to the next 12 months, a 82.09% change is anticipated, leading to a potential return between 14.57% and 93.13%. This equates to a price range of $1,002.78 to $1,690.40 after a year. Our latest update on NVIDIA reveals significant movements in the stock price, with a 12.59% fluctuation between the day's high and low. The stock price saw a decline of minus 5.55% on Friday, dropping from $926.69 to $875.28. Throughout the trading day, it ranged from a low of $865.06 to a high of $974, indicating a volatility of 12.59%. Over the past 10 days, the price has increased in 7 instances, rising by 11.05% in the last 2 weeks. Despite a surge in trading volume of 54 million shares, the price decline signals a potential increase in risk in the coming days. A total of 112 million shares were exchanged, amounting to approximately $97.74 billion. Looking back over 52 weeks, the stock hit a peak of $974 and a low of $222.97. Currently, it sits 10.14% below the 52-week high, translating to a difference of $98.72. This high also marks the all-time peak for NVIDIA stock. Analyst Ratings On Thursday, February 29, 2024, Tigris Financial rated NVIDIA as a buy with a hold action. On Wednesday, February 28, 2024, Bank of America Securities rated NVIDIA as a buy with a hold action. On Thursday, February 22, 2024, KeyBank rated NVIDIA as overweight with a hold action. On Friday, February 16, 2024, Oppenheimer rated NVIDIA as outperform with a hold action. On Wednesday, February 14, 2024, Susquehanna rated NVIDIA as positive with a hold action. Analysts have assigned a general rating of strong buy to NVIDIA stock. They consider the P-E ratio and price to book both as strong buy. When it comes to return on investment, experts also give the stock a rating of strong buy. Identified signals for NVIDIA NVIDIA stock shows buy signals from short and long-term moving averages, indicating a positive forecast. A general buy signal is present as the short-term average is above the long-term average. Support levels at $859.27 and $720.91 may offer resistance in case of corrections. A breakdown below these levels could trigger sell signals. Additionally, a buy signal is evident from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Despite some negative signals, including a recent sell signal, caution is advised for near-term development. 
Volume increase on declining prices suggests potential future declines. Monitoring the stock closely is recommended. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, sell signal 2 days ago. Bollinger, by signal 38 days ago. Short-term moving average, by signal 13 days ago. Long-term moving average, by signal 45 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, by signal 45 days ago. The long-term moving average, by signal 87 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, by signal 77 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss for NVIDIA. On the downside, NVIDIA has support levels at $788.17 and $785.38. When a stock tests a support level, there is a risk involved as it may move to the next support level if the current one is broken. In this case, if $788.17 is breached, the next support levels are at $785.38 and $694.52. NVIDIA is considered high risk due to its volatility, with a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band. In the last day, the stock moved $108.94 between high and low, equivalent to 12.59%. Over the past week, the daily average volatility has been 5.44%. Before discussing potential trading levels for NVIDIA, let's review some key fundamental data. Firstly, the price-to-earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is essential. This metric compares a company's current share price to its per-share earnings. A high P-E ratio may indicate an overvalued stock or expectations of future high growth rates. Looking ahead, the next earnings report for Q2 2024 is scheduled for May 22, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates stand at $5.35. These figures can significantly influence stock prices, so stay attentive. Now let's explore potential day trading levels for NVIDIA. In an upward trend, the first resistance level for NVIDIA is at $887. Consider waiting for this level to be breached before entering a position if you don't own any shares. For current stockholders, this level could be ideal for swing trading. On the downside, Nvidia faces its initial support level at $788.17. If this support level holds, it might serve as a strategic entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for NVIDIA from multiple analyst sources is a strong buy. Now, let's delve into some recent insider trades. On March 5, 2024, Drell Persis conducted an insider sell of 5,000 shares of common stock. On March 4, 2024, Stevens Mark A conducted an insider sell of 6,000 shares of common stock. On March 4, 2024, Stevens Mark A conducted another insider sell of 6,000 shares of common stock. On March 5, 2024, Cox Tench conducted an insider sell of 1,000 shares of common stock. On March 5, 2024, Cox Tench conducted another insider sell of 9,590 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider power is calculated to be negative with a ratio of minus 50.839. Overall, insiders purchased 396,501 shares and sold 1,124,686 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $834.84, representing a decrease of 4.62%. This stock exhibits significant daily volatility, indicating a high level of risk. A sell signal from a pivot top was identified just one day ago. Is Nvidia stock a good buy? Based on our analysis, several short-term signals, along with a positive trend, indicate a buying opportunity for Nvidia stock. We have upgraded our evaluation from a hold-slash-accumulate to a buy candidate. 
Our system suggests that the current price is undervalued after analyzing the recent volatility and movements in the market. Looking ahead to trading on Monday, March 11th, we anticipate Nvidia to open up at $29.50 and start trading at $904.78. Trading comes with a high risk of financial loss. It is important to consult a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Stockinvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By using this information, you are responsible for your own investment outcomes. Presenting our current analysis of the stock. We value your opinion, so feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below. What price target do you have in mind for this stock? Don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates. Wishing you success in your trading endeavors and have a wonderful day from all of us at Stock Invest.